In the hallowed halls of history, certain stories like precious gems have been buried beneath the sands of time. Today, we embark on a journey to unveil a chapter seldom discussed. The lives of ten black European rulers whose remarkable reigns have remained hidden in the shadows of history's grand narrative. These ten remarkable individuals, spanning different epochs and regions of Europe, transcended the racial boundaries of their time and etched their names into the annals of European history. Ethelstan of East Anglia, 895-939 CE. Our journey commences in early medieval England, where Ethelstan stands as a luminous figure. Born in 895 CE, he would later rise to become the first king of England, reigning from 924 to 939 CE. But what remains hidden is the fact that Ethelstan's mother, Osbur, had North African ancestry, marking a unique heritage in the Anglo-Saxon monarchy. Stats Ethelstan's reign was a transformative era for England, marked by the unification of various Anglo-Saxon -Sax kingdoms into a single powerful entity, setting the stage for the emergence of the English monarchy. His legacy endures, having laid the foundations for the nation's future rulers, King Jaume Frey of Aragon, 1208-1276 CE. Our next stop takes us to the Kingdom of Aragon in Spain, where King Jaume Frey, born in 1208, would ascend to the throne and rule until 1276 CE. His reign was instrumental in the Reconquista, the gradual recapture of Iberian lands from Moorish rule. Hidden beneath the layers of history is the revelation that Jaume I's maternal lineage traced back to North Africa through his mother, Violante of Hungary, who was a descendant of Saint Maurice. Stats, King Jaume. His legacy is interwoven with the Reconquista, a monumental period in Iberian history. His reign saw the conquest of Valencia and the formation of the Crown of Aragon, which would later become a significant political entity within the Mediterranean region. Queen Charlotte of Great Britain, 1744-1818 CE. Crossing the English Channel, we encounter Queen Charlotte, consort of King George III of Great Britain. Born in mecklenburg strelitz Germany, in 1744, her reign lasted until 1818. What remains concealed in the annals of European history is her African ancestry. Stats Queen Charlotte's influence extended far beyond her role as a consort. Her patronage of the arts and sciences enriched the British court during the 18th century, contributing to a cultural renaissance. Yet her African heritage has rarely been acknowledged, leaving her unique place in history obscured. General Thomas Alexandre Dumas 1762-1806 CE. The tumultuous era of the French Revolution introduced us to General Thomas Alexandre Dumas, born in Haiti in 1762. His life spanned until 1806, and within those years, he would become one of the most distinguished military leaders of revolutionary France. The hidden gem of his story lies in the fact that he was a man of African descent, challenging the racial barriers of his time. Stats. General Dumas's military achievements and heroism are legendary, symbolizing the revolutionary ideals of the French Republic. His leadership inspired future generations and even found its way into the works of Alexandre Dumas, one of France's most celebrated authors. Abram Petrovich Gannibal, 1696-1781 CE. Our journey carries us to the vast expanse of Russia, where we encounter Abram Petrovich Gannibal. Born in 1696 as an African nobleman, his journey took him from captivity to the Russian court. Over his long life, which extended until 1781, he rose to become a general and engineer. Stats. Gannibal's contributions to Russia extended far beyond his military service. He was not only a key figure in the nation's engineering projects, but also the great-grandfather of Alexander Pushkin, one of Russia's most revered poets. His legacy is intertwined with the cultural and intellectual heritage of Russia. Hedvig Sophia of Sweden, 1681-1708 CE. In the courts of Sweden during the late 17th century, Queen Hedvig Sophia, born in 1681, stands as a testament to the diversity within European nobility. 
She reigned briefly from 1697 to 1708. Stats Queen Hedvig Sophia's reign may have been short, but her presence in the Swedish court reflects the multicultural nature of European society during her era. Her story serves as a reminder that people of diverse backgrounds played significant roles in European history, even within the highest echelons of nobility. King Peter II of Portugal, 1648-1706 CE. Portugal, a nation of maritime explorers, saw King Peter II's rule during a critical period in its history. Born in 1648, he reigned from 1683 to 1706. Hidden within his lineage is his connection to African heritage through his maternal lineage. Stats King Peter II's reign coincided with Portugal's struggle for independence from Spain. His leadership was instrumental during this period of political turmoil and cultural transformation. His rule marks a significant chapter in Portugal's history. King Alfonso VIII of Castile, 1155-1214 CE, the 12th century in Spain, witnessed the rule of King Alfonso VIII of Castile. Born in 1155, his reign lasted until 1214. Hidden within the layers of history is the revelation that his mother, Queen Berengaria, had North African roots. Stats King Alfonso VIII's reign was a pivotal moment in the Reconquista, a centuries-long effort to reclaim the Iberian Peninsula from Muslim rule. His leadership and military campaigns had far-reaching implications for the history of Spain and its cultural diversity. Chevalier de Saint-Georges, 1745-1799 CE In 18th century France, the multi-talented Chevalier de Saint-Georges emerged as a beacon of talent and courage. Born in 1745, his life extended until 1799. His remarkable story hidden behind the veil of history, is that of a man of African descent who excelled in music, fencing, and military service. Stats The Chevalier de Saint-Georges' contributions to French culture and his mastery of both the arts and the military broke racial barriers during a time of profound social change. His legacy endures in the pages of history and in the hearts of those who appreciate his extraordinary talents. Sir Archibald Dunbar, 1740-1828 CE. Our journey concludes in the rugged Scottish Highlands, where Sir Archibald Dunbar, born in 1740, lived until 1828. He was a military officer and landowner of both African and Scottish descent, representing the rich diversity of Scotland's past. Stats. Sir Archibald Dunbar's life reflects the complexities of identity and heritage in the Scottish context. He is a testament to the intricate history of Scotland, bridging continents and cultures in a land known for its fierce independence. These ten black European rulers, whose remarkable stories are often overlooked, challenge conventional narratives and enrich the mosaic of Europe's history. Their lives, achievements and legacies demonstrate the enduring impact of diversity and resilience in shaping our shared past. As we conclude this journey of rediscovery, let us remember that history, like these rulers, is a tapestry woven from diverse threads, each thread contributing to the story of our shared past. These rulers, though hidden for centuries, now shine as luminous beacons illuminating the paths of those who dare to seek the untold stories that lie beneath the surface of our past. Please like, share, and subscribe to know more about black history.